invite President Ye Gong Ping to deliver his opening address. Yeah! Mr. Don and welcome to the hero. Let's have a seat. There are no women, of course. Agora Speakers Club does not operate in a vacuum. We operate in the real world. And in the real world, there are many realities. One of which is, you need to be effective. It doesn't matter whether you are a millionaire, a CEO, or a clerk, or a driver. It doesn't matter if you have a degree or you fail your primary school exam. It doesn't matter if you have a million dollars or you only have ten dollars in your pocket. But when you come up to speak, you are a salesman. You are selling ideas, you are selling products, you are selling services, you are selling something, information, and this is a prospective customer. If they don't buy, you fail. If they don't understand what you are saying, if they don't believe what you say, if they will not do what you ask of them, you fail. That is the reality of the world here. Now, no matter what we do, we want honest, open feedback so that we can learn, we can improve. It's no use telling you wonderful, 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 but nobody believes you. Right? So that is a challenge today. Whoever comes out to speak, whether impromptu basis or whatever, remember you are the salesman. You can never say, I am so clever, I got a wonderful product, I explain so clearly, this guy is so stupid, he doesn't want to buy. That's not the way. If that guy don't buy, he just don't buy. I don't care how clever you are, how rich you are, you are CEO, you are whatever, I don't care. You feel. That is the reality. Right? And this is what we want, the real world experience. If you've got good language, good vocal variety, good whatever, but nobody believes you, it's not good. You can have all kinds of titles behind your name, but if you cannot sell and the people can don't buy, that's not good. That is the game we play, the real game of life here. So take your work seriously, learn and improve every time. Can you agree on that? Yes. Thank you. I'll hand over to Don. Thank you very much, President Yevangri. Now we'll move on to invite our grammarian. A grammarian is somebody who introduces us to the word of the day. The grammarian today is Elsa Lim. Elsa Lim is a life coach who wants to guide you towards achieving your dreams and goals. Wow! She is also the author of the book Where Love and Money Are Gone. Wow! wow. Now let us invite Elsa Lim who will introduce us the word of the day. Yeah. <laughs> Good evening everyone! Good evening! Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Now, uh, my role this evening is to listen very intensely to what you say, what comes out of your mouth, and to note any grammar mistakes, any mispronounced words, and to alert you about them, because there's nothing more embarrassing than to use wrong grammar and mispronounced words, especially when, as Mr. Gay says, when you are trying to impress someone maybe a client, or maybe a top management, or, or just someone. So, yeah, a girl, yeah, exactly, yeah. So, you have to choose a girlfriend who doesn't speak English very well, then you can get a girl. <laughs> so, uh, one, of the, uh, one of the objectives is also to introduce uh, all of you to new words, new words that you can use in your language in the future so that you can impress that girl, right? Or impress that client. So the word today is called TAD. Uh, hands up, how many of you know this word TAD? T-A-D. Right, okay. The, the 
the native speakers all know this word TED. Now, TED is a very interesting word. I looked it up in the dictionary. It actually stands for a little bit. So instead of saying a little bit, I want a little bit of chili. You can just be very classy, impress that girlfriend of yours, you know, to, may I have a tad more chili please? Oh, um, wow. A tad more chili. And then, and then if, if let's say um, you need someone to, to you, need, you need the chairs to be moved, anything to be moved or anything, as long as you substitute the word a little bit, uh, with the word cat. Like, move, please move a little to the left. Uh, can, can we, uh, can you move a little, uh, can you move cat to the left? No, something like that, right? <laughs> okay, you get the picture, and so please use this word. Thank you.